Welcome back, guys. So, the collective message, guys. I'm hearing that somebody has some something that they need to confess to you. Okay, somebody has something that they want to tell you, confess to you, something that they have been holding in, um, and that they are ready to talk about this. They're ready to open up and be transparent with you. All right, so let's go ahead and get the message from this person and see what this person wants to tell you. What does this person want to confess? Show me this person's energy. What does this person want to confess? Yes. Queen of Swords and the Ace, the Page of Wands here. They do want to tell you the truth. Okay. I'm hearing like a real friend. Or real close. They were scared to tell you. And something about the past. Something about the past. Something didn't work. Okay. Something did not work. Um. It's why something didn't work. They had something to do with why something did not work. It had something to do that about a decision. Okay. This person had a decision to make. They didn't want to make this decision. They didn't want to have to make this decision. It definitely has something to do with why something didn't work out in the past. Somebody's uh, walked away or completely emotionally disconnected from this connection. But they kept coming around you, even though they weren't emotionally there. They weren't emotionally there, but they kept coming around. Like, I just feel like someone kept falling for it. This could very much so be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, because we got the King of Swords and the Queen of Swords here, and they're both facing each other. Like, one's on one side. It's like they're having a conversation here. As well as the double and the king of pentacles here could be Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, queen of pentacles is here too. Okay, so we got the king of pentacles and the queen of pentacles. So for some of you, this is a partner. This is somebody that you were partnered up with. All right, let's go ahead and see what this person wants to say. Because I, I want to see about this four of cups is here though. This is a choice that they didn't really want to make, but they had a decision that they had to make. Why is the Four of Cups here? Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, this person felt like they should go ahead and tell you the truth that maybe they want to slow things down because they was confused about what they wanted or who they wanted. King of Pentacles. So this could be a Virgo Taurus Capricorn. This person is very um, in and out. Like this person is very unstable. Um, they're here one minute and they're going the next minute. This person is currently spying on you. Okay, they're spying on you. It's like, what's next? What should I do now? What should I do now? Yeah, 
yeah, this person, they had a hard time making up their mind, or this is current. They haven't made up their mind on whether or not if they are going to actually leave. I feel like this person has already already emotionally checked out of the situation, but they haven't actually drug their actually drug their feet out of the situation. So I'm hearing that. I thought we was closer than that. I'm hearing you could have just told me the truth because I thought we was closer than that. But this was hard for this person to do. Yeah, three of cups, three of swords. There could have been third party energy. But there could have been a breakup, a separation. Yeah, I'm getting a separation. Yeah, somebody feels like they sh they're better off single. Somebody feels like they're better off single, like they get more accomplished when they're single. They don't feel like they owe, um, this person doesn't feel like they owe you anything. They just feel like they're better off single. Okay, they're they're just better off or you're better off single. They don't feel like like they owe you anything. Okay. I want to find out who this energy is and what are their intentions. Like, first let's see what else they want to say first. We're going to use these. Let's see. What does this person want to confess? I wonder if you're happy without me. Yeah, see, I feel like this was hard for this person. This is hard for this person to let you go. This isn't an easy task, but they feel like that you're better off single or you're better off without them or they're better off without you. They feel like they don't owe you anything. But they're wondering, like, are you happy without me? They feel like you two were too young. Maybe you got it, got with this person when you were young. Maybe y'all got married young. Maybe y'all had children together young. Maybe y'all were just dating, you know, high school sweethearts, something like that. This person says they love you. And they wish that they could share their good news with you. But the thing about it is, is this person, this person's life is not completely together as it seems. Because we got my life is not together as it seems. But this person is having a hard time letting you go, okay? But at the same time, they feel like you're better off without them. They're better off without you. Um, and they feel like they don't owe you anything. That's the part that, I, that I'm tripping on. Like, they feel like they don't owe you anything. Then why is it hard to let go? All right, so tell me more. What does this person want to confess? What does this person want to confess to the collection? What does this person want to confess? That just jumped out. Oh, these cards are jumping. Oh, okay, 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 okay. okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, they just came out together. We're going to leave them together. What does this person want to confess?
this is somebody who is very aggressive. Their energy is very aggressive. Like they're they, they feel really strongly about the situation. So just just using that as a disclaimer. I told you this person is watching you. This person is waiting on you to reach out to them and uh, tell them how you feel. I'm getting a King of Pentacles and a Strength here. So it could be a Leo and a Capricorn. We got the King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Okay. Like I said, this person has been being very patient, waiting on you to contact them, waiting for you to reach out to them. Waiting on you to tell them how you feel about some type of change. My ears are ringing. About some type of change that they could have made or the change, the, the changes that's going on between you and them. Yeah, see, these cards are jumping. This person is in 10 of wands energy, okay? They are burnt out. They are losing patience. They, they have lost patience. They're losing patience. Why is the Ten of Wands here? This person is burned out by this situation. Why is the Ten of Wands here? The Tower. Yeah, I can't make it up. This person is burnt out. This this is like burnt down to the ground. This person has lost all patience with this situation. They wanna they wanna call you. They wanna talk to you so bad. I right, but can they, they wanna call you so bad, but they feel like you're not gonna answer the phone. Maybe it keeps going to the voicemail. I keep hearing phone keeps going to the voicemail. I'm not sure if you block this person. I'm not sure if you block this person. Okay. So this person feel like, you know what? You won. You got it. I feel like this person was calling back to back. Okay. They were calling back to back. And it was going straight to voicemail. Some of y'all don't block this person. Okay, but this is why this person is so surprised. This person is like, what? What? I told you, this person's energy is very aggressive, okay? The way these cards are just flipping out, flipping over, jumping out, going straight. Like, this person wants this message to get out, Okay. Some type of shocking truth could have gotten out. Why is this King of Wands here? Oh, these cards are just flipping over. This person wants to take action, but they're stuck. Okay. I'm getting the truth. They told you the truth. And then as soon as that truth got out, it ended. It was over. That chapter was closed. It's like, okay, told the truth, closed chapter. Okay. I'm getting this did not stop this person from telling lies or being sneaky or cheating. It actually turned it actually turned somebody up even more. Um it actually turned the, it actually flipped the situation upside down. It's what it did. I'm getting that some type of truth is getting ready to be revealed or the truth has already came out. Okay, but one thing is for sure that I know for a fact that this person is falling apart. This person is losing patience in this situation. They want to take action right now, but they feel stuck. They feel like they can't move. They can't move forward. Queen of Wands. Got the King of Wands and the Queen of Wands here. 
Leo Sagittarius Aries. I keep saying, telling the truth, telling the truth, couldn't make up their mind what they wanted to do, started stressing out, and decided to just close the chapter. It ended. It ended on bad terms. The devil. It ended on bad terms. This person want to take action so bad. They want to take action towards you. This person is studying you. Okay, this person could have a third party. This third party could be a five of wands. Could be in competition with you. Okay, could be this argue, disagreement over a man or a woman. I'm seeing that as well too. Okay, now the page of pentacles is here. The high priestess. This person is saying, I know you see me calling you. Why is the high priestess here? This person says, it's like you knew. Like you, you knew. This person knows that they, that they caused you some type of pain. They know that they caused you some type of pain. They just, they want to talk about it. Like for some reason, they want to talk about it. Like this person's waiting for you to cry. Waiting on you to cry. This person knows, they know. They knew that they hurt you. Now they want to talk about it. Queen of Swords. Because now they want to change your mind. The challenge is trying to change your mind. So they did some damage to you. I'm getting this is a damage. They know that they damaged the situation. They know that it was their fault that this whole thing happened. They know it's their fault that everything fell apart. So now they want to try to change your mind. But some of y'all ain't nowhere to be found. Some of y'all are not competing for this person. Some of y'all have isolated yourself from this connection. Because it's like, for what? We got two people right here. A Leo and a Virgo, Taurus, or a Capricorn. I'm here and give me a call. This person could be uh, finally getting their confidence up. I'm here and give me a call. I'm here and keep calling. Keep calling. Yeah, this person is having regrets. Could be a Capricorn. This person know that they screwed up. Queen of Pentacles could be an Earth sign. I'm hearing a better choice. You were this person's best choice. Um, they betrayed you in some way, shape, or form. Okay. Now they're over here having regrets. Yep, you're not going for it. You're not picking up. I'm hearing this person is calling you and you have this person blocked or you changed your number. This person doesn't know how to get in contact with you. Um, they don't know what action to take to get towards you. All they know and what all they've been doing is spying. You got the star card here. Could be an Aquarius. Yeah, this person's been spying on you. They've been hoping that you guys could start over. We got the Fool and the Six of Swords. They're hoping that you could start over. I'm hearing single or not. I didn't want this situation to be like, I didn't want it to be like this. But whether we work on this relationship or not, I feel like, you know, we should, shouldn't should part ways like this or it shouldn't go down like this, okay? Relationship, I'm hearing relationship or not. You is the best choice. Okay, this person struggled with a uh, commitment as well. Like this person struggles, this person has a hard time being faithful or struggle has some type of struggle in the commitment department. Okay, they feel like they should have waited to make some type of decision, but they want to go ahead and get the truth off their chest. They want to go ahead and get that off their chest. Okay, I feel like they could have possibly, it could have been a, a pregnancy scare. 
somebody kept I'm hearing somebody kept kept saying that they was pregnant, but couldn't find out they lied. Okay, we got the sun and the empress. That definitely symbolizes a pregnancy. Um, but they lied with the seven of swords. This person was just trying something new. Um, they just was trying something different. They wanted to do something different. I feel like they plan on coming back to you. We got the two of wands and the six of cups. But you left for good this time. Eight of cups and the judgment. This is where at the moment that this person realized that they fucked all the way up. This person wants a new start. Nine of Cups and the Ace of Wands. This person wants a new start. Okay. This person wanted to see if they could slow you down, but you kept going. You kept going. You won. You won because you left the situation. Judgment and the Eight of Cups. Some of y'all walked away from somebody that you were very comfortable with. Y'all started a life together. Y'all could have been married with this Four of Wands energy. It's like some I'm hearing come back home. The Four of Wands and the Six of Cups. Okay. Somebody is like, the plan was for us to get back together. The plan was for was never for uh, us to be apart from each other. You feel like this person is manipulative. King of Cups and the Seven of Swords. One thing that I know about this King of Cups and the Seven of Swords is that this King of Cups, he's full of love, but don't get it twisted. You know, don't get it twisted. You feel like this person manipulated you. Played mind games with you. This person thinks that you're tired of them. I'm getting Pisces, the moon and the queen of cups, the devil here. I feel like for some of y'all, this is a Capricorn or somebody that's really, really toxic. They got like some type of addictions or... My left eye keeps jumping. They have some type of addiction or codependent issues or something like that. Um, yeah, look at this. Five of Pentacles and a Nine of Pentacles. They feel like you're tired of helping them, tired of uh, them being in your space. So maybe you needed some space with the Hermit. Work on some things. But they feel like you, they fear that you're, you know, tired of dealing with them. But here they come with that Knight of Swords. That Ace of Swords. This is something they want to confess. I feel like they're even confessing this to family. That they want to get back together. They want to come back. Got the Knight of Swords. This person is running back to you. Ace of Swords, Ten of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles. This person knows that they have a decision that they have to make. Some of them have to stand up to people in their family, people that they're close to. This person is trying to contact you. This person is trying to get in touch with you. This person is still holding on to you. They have not let you go. We got the justice and the lovers. They still love you the same. They still love you the same. Nothing has changed. Yep, it said that it, that didn't that never stopped. They just had an awakening. The sun and the judgment. 
and they saying you won. Listen, when you walked away, when you finally walked away from this person, this woke this person the hell up. Five of Swords and the Six of Wands. They say you won. You won. You got me on that one. You won. They've been thinking about you every day. They've been thinking about you every day. They've been thinking about this connection. They've been thinking about how everything went down. They're losing patience. They're damn near going crazy. I'm hearing, and my mind's going half crazy because I can't leave you alone. Half crazy by Music Soul Child. This person def definitely, definitely. Now let's see what this person has been having going on, okay? Let's see what this person, a little bit of insight of what this person has been going on, what's been going on between them and whatever they've been doing while you guys are been in separation. They've been in another connection. You got seduction and heart with the key. They've been in another connection because they can, don't know any other way to, to heal. They got coughing and healing heart. But they have been messing. They've been in other in another connection. We got seduction and heart with the key. But we got not today. They did this because they was angry. Not hit, not dealing hurt, avoiding the conversation, not calling, um, not wanting to talk, still angry. This person has not healed. They haven't healed. They haven't healed. But they have been in another connection. They have been doing other something else elsewhere. All right. So that's the message that I got for you guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in that comment section below. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and click the bell to subscribe. As well, share with your family and your friends. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.